Hey, I had to make a quick video on this because I figured I might not be able to do this in the show. But if you notice, nowadays, everybody miserable. Everybody, everybody always so mad, you feel me? So goddamn me, you know? Anti-happiness, so goddamn me, pessimistic. Motherfuckers, goddamn me, just, you go in a spot and start achieving, you know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers in the corner just waiting on you, just don't let them, that's, and I think that's why I came to that. I think that's why God put it on my mind early to say that. Have you a routine to defeat this? Have you something that you do? Get out, put your cell phone in the car, leave that shit in the whip, leave it in your house, whatever. Go walk. Go stand on the other edge of some water. Read, but just put your phone down and really just touch grass because it's like, and this honestly what came to my mind, bro. Real shit, before I made this video, this really what came to my mind. Raw, unadulterated. It's like everybody mad at black men. It's like everybody mad because they looking at the black man and thinking that we would have been by it down way more by now. We would have been way more in a just fucked off slave. Yes, sir. <laughs> You know, I'ma serve, you know, we, we just gonna give all of us and all the best of us to y'all and I want none and y'all to be more thriving. Straight up. The truth is much stranger than fiction. So what you just heard me say might not even sound right at first. But really think about it, my nigga. Everything that make the world go round. Everything that make the motherfucking me world go round, man get made better by black men. Now, this is what I mean even going into the biblical side of how deep this shit really could get. You feel me? I'm just trying to keep it GQ on some shit and keep it service level, keep it cool type shit. You feel me? But, like, without me even jumping into the Bible and just bronze skin, hair or wool, Y'all made in the image of me. That another reason why I say I'ma go back and reread is because a lot of people be thinking I'm speaking out of hate. My niggas, I'm speaking out of facts out the fucking Bible, man. Nigga, they hated us to a point where they planned though. When I say they man, my nigga it said all the motherfucking tribes. So all y'all niggas out there that do all that old rinky dink laws tribe poop put ass shit of saying Mexicans can say nigga cause they with us and 12 tribes they my brother hey no 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 taking away from y'all right no disrespect to y'all right but check that out over here on this channel my niggas say nah man because how you treat a motherfucker is how you feel about them so for the fact that us niggas be out here ass the fuck out everybody be going in on us trying to make us go out bad and just you feel what i'm saying nigga get treated like the bottom of the other of the shoe feel what I'm saying? Nigga, the world has shown us. The world has shown us. Because damn, they look like the, the longer we go. You could say it's Old Testament, but I'll be goddamn if even as the Bible go into how you transition to that New Testament, be finishing that motherfucker right. I'll be goddamn if because I hear niggas say this shit almost as if like, well, you need to move on. Nigga, as if the shit in the Old Testament stopped being true. Nigga, as if the shit in the Old Testament stop, man. So, nah, man. Um, I'm talking about every other single motherfucking me tribe that I be seeing on these videos on social media where niggas that had these fancy doodad ass charts that had a little lines to say Mexican, African, Asian, uh, Caucasoid, white, and, uh, yeah, this race and that to put the put the put the how we all support nigga, please. I'll never forget the day. This how I know God had put that shit up on me. My nigga, I was going through so much spiritual strife, just sensing shit, picking up on things about how people really felt about a nigga. 
I'm talking about I'm reading my Bible. I'm reading that motherfucker. You hear me? Next motherfucking day, I'll never forget I read that motherfucking verse. It was on there. I'm going to go back and read it. God willing, y'all to see. It was on the right side. I'll never forget I want to say. It was towards the top. I know that for goddamn. But when I read that motherfucker say, the other tribes envied them so much, they plotted to have them slain in the field of beasts. I said, oh, Lord. So, um, nah, man, um, yeah, I, I just had to make this one real quick, though, uh, you know what I'm saying, nigga, everybody's miserable, cause shit is slowly crumbling, and they know, everybody know it's slowly coming out and being exposed that the black man, the black man that was following God, walking in the ways of God, was the one that was gifted with the juice to make all this shit here jump and make that shit snazzy and jazzy for real. Now everything getting fucked up and falling apart and drying up. Now these... Oh boy, I gotta stop saying I forget this YouTube. All these actors running around, fucked off. Now you seeing them at Walmart. Which hey, I ain't finna sugarcoat a bitch ass thing over here. Check this out. I don't harbor hatred in my heart for none of y'all automatically, cause how you treat me, I'ma reciprocate. But I'd be a damn lie to say it don't make me happy to see y'all motherfuckers of other races be po and ass out on the street. Where nigga, some of the most honorable black men got slain and laid on like rabbit dogs. Yeah, 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 now nah, say, I like seeing that shit, my nigga. Cause truth be told to me and my perspective, that's God letting y'all bitch ass off the hook easier, really trying to show grace than what he could be getting y'all on. The fuck wrong with you? But anyway, see how see how you get to talking? Nigga, y'all niggas in them fancy cars and them BMWs and Mercedes, boy, y'all be about ready to get y'all ass whipped the way y'all drive in traffic. But, uh, I mean, to get the following all behind a nigga doing that swerve left and right shit, making a nigga think, oh, he don't want to fight when we hit this stop sign. Uh, but now, <coughs> like I say, niggas, Stay privy to this shit and don't let these miserable motherfuckers drive drive you into this bullshit. They all these niggas out here that's that that realize that relying on this pagan uh ACA man system that they thought was gonna secure them for centuries. Say that shit crumbling so fast now in, in real time. Don't let them drag you into that misery. Misery. Stay positive. And stay light in your mind and way you're thinking because see, all of these and remember this too, this is what I really want to hit on too. I saw a saying on Instagram where the man say, uh, a lion don't forget who poked him through the cage. Yeah, let me say that again. A lion don't forget who poked him through the cage. See, all us po ass niggas out here that just kept it real, didn't do all that faking and flodging ass shit. You know, we ain't lay on your little funky ass jobs when y'all fired us because we ain't want to uh, parlay with y'all at the work. We ain't laugh at your awkward jokes. You know, we ain't come to work and kiss your ass and try to be your man and uh, 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 follow you on the gram and like your photos and make you feel like we were enamored by your presence. Yeah, yeah, no, nah, uh, we didn't forget. So, niggas, don't forget. Uh, yeah. Don't forget when when it when when the tables turn and the lads become first. Like, see, I don't know if y'all saw that, but uh, just man, it be niggas strewn about in the fucking streets. It be niggas strewn about in the streets, dog. Uh, nigga, the word strewn about is like if you were to take a basket of laundry and just throw it about. Niggas be strewn about in the streets, whereas you see these same people go and save a damn funky ass, matted fur, 
mangy ass cat. You hear what I'm saying? Veterans included now. God damn. Shit. Niggas be driving so goddamn fast. You hit my shit, see your bullets don't follow. Crazy fool. Motherfucker be driving so fast to go nowhere. It, this is how you know people miserable. People be driving fast all over the world now just to go places and do this here at black men. Nigga, please say, you're not crazy black men. The same voice and intuition that woke me up and put it on me to say this to the world. You got that shit too. If you watching this video, more than likely you got that shit too. Let that shit come up at you, my nigga. I heard Blueface say, you can't go far if you don't take that shit further. Take it further, my nigga. God first. 